I've been watching a lot of Luke Combs videos because I'm moving to Calgary in a month. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm becoming a country guy. Let's just get right into it. Just doing a classic looking at old pictures of myself because what's better than making fun of other people? Making fun of yourself. Let me get pictures when I'm a baby. I have a bunch of pictures of me from like 14 onwards. Anywhere from like 5 to 14 is just lost, long forgotten. I don't know what happened to it. Some pictures of me when I was a baby. Not much to make fun of because I was super cute baby, but my parents kind of gave me that neo-Nazi haircut and I kind of have the hairline that my dad has. I used to be blonde when I was a kid. I had blonde hair. Anyway, like I said, kind of from from 10 to 14 is just lost long regarded. So that's where we're going to pick up. This is a picture of me I found on Facebook. <laughs> When I was 14, I didn't know I ever went through acne, but, or I just didn't know how to shave. Look at this little fresh beard. I didn't have a beard at all. I had no facial hair. Eyebrows are literally the same. They might even be bigger in this picture. But I had like, did I have a mega chin? Is that why I grew out a beard? <laughs> this was back when my ears were normal too. I think this was 20, 2013, maybe 2012. I got the London 2012 shirt on. I don't know what to say it. My grandpa's arm is around me, but I guess for some reason that got cropped out when I put it on Facebook. Yeah, and I would smile with teeth. I don't know what's going on with my hair. Just a strand down like I'm an e-boy. This is when I'm 15. That's Matt Barnes, actually. We saw him in the streets of uh, Boston. <laughs> it's a picture of me and my brother. This dude's kind of random in the back, but I don't know why I decided to crop it, so it was just me. I guess I thought it was a good picture of me, even though I'm squinting to no ends. Canada Cup shirt on. I used to only wear free shirts. I had no drip back in the day. My brother has this picture too, and he cropped just me out. He left him and Matt Barnes, but he cropped hit, cropped me out. I don't know what's going on here. This is like a group photo, but I guess I didn't know what was going on. This was like in grade 12. I learned how to grow a beard, but I wasn't good at styling it, so my beard would just kind of grow, and then I would shave it occasionally, and I just have so much hair. I must have realized I was losing it and just like been trying to keep it as long as I could because it looks like I'd be ready to donate to charity. This is also my ears started getting messed up. My ears started getting up it messed up in grade nine. This is me in grade 10. <laughs> Matman wrestler wins national championship. This is me where I just look probably as sad as you can get. I don't know what's going on. I had tape around my head because both my ears were like ready to explode. But I won that tournament. It was a national tournament. I am pale, man. Yeah, I just didn't care. And I had zero definition anywhere in my body. I'm just like one straight, pale, white child that looks like he's had depression his entire life. Anyway, this one's funny. They had me take these pictures in my school gym, and I'm super fat in them because I was just eating all the time because it was like not during wrestling. So I was super fat. <laughs> and they had me take these pictures and the way the gym worked was it was like the gym and then there's a, a lift weightlifting gym up top. So there's like the basketball courts and then the weightlifting gym can look down. So everyone's just staring at me in this goofy ass singlet. And like I wasn't uncomfortable with being in a singlet, but also they want everyone staring at me with a singlet. There's also like a funny article where like I make it sound like I'm, I'm fucking michael jordan i'll read it to you grappler rebounds for national team spot ty bridgewater says it's his losses this season he remembers the most well when you only have four on the wrestling mat compared to 41 wins those prat matches probably stand out more than others how do i even know that stat because nobody kept track of those in canadian wrestling it wasn't like a known stat that was kept like somebody had to keep track of those himself I was such a loser. This one's funny. This one's just me. I think I'm in grade 12 here, but I won a championship and it just looked provincial and it just looks like everyone's looking at my dick. <laughs> like who, who, I think I posted this picture like I was cool too, like not even realizing. It's just like everyone around is looking at me. It's kind of uncomfortable when you look at it for too long. You guys do want to see something embarrassing though that I did? I'm so embarrassed about this. The story is this is this is 2017 Junior National Championships under 20. So under 20 years old, you're allowed to compete in this. If you win this, you get to pay $3,000 to go to the World Championships. So here I am winning this, and then watch how I react.
<laughs> it's just a lot. It's just, it's just so much. This is me at an athletic banquet, <laughs> which like, what, a, what is going on with me? I'm wearing these dusty ass shoes, khaki pants, like I'm a golfer. Like I'm about to go play 18 holes after this. And this was like probably the last time I had hair. This was before my hair started receding. But this is also when I would smile with teeth because I don't smile with teeth in pictures because I look super awkward like this. Cause now I just do the, I mean, it, it's better than, than this when i got into university you had to take pictures of like pictures for one for your student card and two for your athlete profile so they give you this red shirt and i would wear like a shirt under it and then they take your picture so one year that i took it well, it wasn't bad. It's not a bad picture. This isn't a bad picture. This is my first year of university. I still had hair. I didn't really shave my beard. Like if I shaved my beard, I would shave it fully. And my ears are kind of janked up, but it's not like the worst picture ever, right? My second year, I don't know what happened to me, but I just had like, I wore like a white shirt underneath. They gave me something that was too small. I mean, I'm giving this creepy smile like I'm about to murder the photographer and my beard looks patchy like what's going on with my chin ah oh, and like my hair is kind of I'm trying to hold on to it like I'm still young my beard's the same length as my hair I'm doing one of those I went with the white shirt I should have taken off the I think they gave me a small shirt it's just all around makes me look so creepy and maybe that's why I never succeeded in school. This one's from like this year. <laughs> it's when I did the wild wing challenge. I had blonde hair when I went through that blonde phase. What a terrible time. Look at how I'm dying. I never thought I would sweat so much in my life, but I guess that's how white I am. These were kind of embarrassing when you think about it. Like, what the fuck is this picture? Don't Google me, man. What am I doing in this? I'm just hugging a shirtless guy. I'm going to leave it on that one. I don't really know if any of those were embarrassing. It's short video this week. Sorry about that. I've been kind of sad. I got in one of my funks and it was hard to get out of. So I thought doing this would get me out of the funk. And it was helpful. Next week, back to the bangers. Peace out. You're the best.